Boys You're, You're watching Boys Fishing Crew. Hey, what's up, guys? So now we filleted the yellowtail, and we got them here. We're gonna um, we're gonna cook them up, like I said, so we can taste them and all the good stuff. Um, so we're gonna pick the loin part, which is here. Oh snap! Um, Clean it all up. Like I said, this fish is super clean, so you don't have to, you know. I mean, you could if you want to wash it with water, but then uh, the way we're gonna cook this, you don't want it to get a lot of water in there because we're gonna wrap it in foil. Yep. And uh, then that foil is gonna have so much water when you open it, so you just want all that flavor in there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna section it, uh, which is section it like that. Section A, section B. <laughs> section A, section B, and they're just gonna fillet up. Oh snap. So, oh, so I'm getting it right there. Um, now I got a grip to You can make it out of uh, shoes out of that if you want. Yeah. <laughs> right. Out of bag. So, so there's a total of seven of us. So I got five, so I need two more. So we're just gonna one, two. Once you hit that cut right there, and then twist your knife outward that way and just Slice a little bit and let the knife do the work. Flip it, now you got a grip. A lot of people too would help if it's slippery. You can poke a hole here, for just for your finger to hold in. Right? And now you can just have that. As long as you don't cut your finger. So, okay. so now we have that. Shout out to my oh, handy dandy shit. assistant, uh, Chris Sherman. He's over there. Right, so, we're gonna have asparagus right here. Oh, guys. snap. One of my so, favorite. There's a trick. I mean, you can't eat, I mean, you can eat all this, but if you wanna chew on that. Oops, sorry. <laughs> you can wanna chew on that, you can chew on that. But the little trick I like to do is some people, they like to take all the rubber band mm -hmm. out of there, and now it's all. Right, so what you wanna do is you just wanna push this in, so you still got. The they're holding it, the grip. And then you just want to cut the stem. Boom. There you go. Now you can just take it off. Once you're done. And then now you can wash it. Do cold water so you don't. gonna go with the seasoning that we're gonna put in here. We're just gonna do a basic um I'll get the funnel side if you don't want that. So now we just what? see There's the purpose of this um yeah I've learned this from them uh <clears throat> every time I come over here before or even now they always have um newspaper yep like this uh what they do is they put it in a counter countertop put the chopping board so as you're 
you're cutting in all the X's, you just put it aside, put it aside, or slide it aside, and then once you're done, once you're done, you just wrap it all up, throw it in the trash can, and you got a clean countertop. So yep, uh, I was gonna do two, but let me see one because one bundle, there's a lot of it already in there. Yeah. So. You know, there's only seven fish. I don't want to, that's too much. So this is already a lot. But if I need to, I just take a little bit in here yeah. and then I just add it. Um, but while we're here, we can just... I can do like a half more of that. Yeah, maybe I'll do yeah. a half more. Then we'll do a lemon, right? So what we're going to do is, because we're going to squeeze fresh lemons in there. I'm going to do a half. So what you gonna uh, do with that, Chef Richie? Oh, uh, yeah, you know. <laughs> All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drizzle this to the fish. So oh, yeah. when we add in the seasoning, we, we're gonna drizzle it to the fish so the fish soak in the um the citrus, citrusy of the lemon and yeah. then it gets into the fish and when you bite it. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. snap. All right, but with this, yes, we're just gonna slice. So we're gonna put this on top of the fish. So we just slice it like that. Two, three, four, and that's edible too, huh? Right? Five. Once yes. you um, Six, put it on top of the fish. Yes. So once you put edible. this on top of the fish, you can uh, squeeze it with the fish too if you need some more uh, lime or lemon. Sorry. Uh, in there. And you can do that. But, yeah, so that's our lemon side. Now we're going to go with the seasoning. Delicious yellow tail. Right? Yellow tail. <laughs> I know. I mean, I get confused too sometimes. <laughs> yellow tail. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna grab just a little bit more, cause somebody here likes asparagus. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, so that way, when you um take a leap, you know, um, later on, it acts like a <laughs> detox too. So that's the reason why yeah. the asparagus have that you know certain aroma when you you know. Uh, smells good. Smells good. <laughs> Preference. <laughs> Same thing, I'm just gonna take that hard part. Push this side like so. This thing is not planned, guys. This is off the fly. You know, we're just going whatever we're thinking of. Yep. And, uh, yeah. So, all right, we'll go with the seasoning. All right, guys, let's go raid um, somebody's uh, spice cabinet here, you know, <laughs> and let's see what he got. Uh, like I said, this is uh, off the fly, like on top. Yep. Top of the head, let's see what we got. We're just, we're just going with it. So, I mean, I'm just going to whatever he got over here. Uh, so, we have pepper. Everybody's favorite garlic salt, right? So, um, a lot of people they like to season with the fish on top. I like to kind of mix mine so you get all that mixture. It's like a rub, yeah, dry rub. So that's how I like to do my seasoning. So, we do our garlic salt because uh, that's a lot of fish that much. Making them dry rub, and then we got pepper. You don't need, you don't need like crazy seasoning, um, but I like to put onions, powder in there just to kind of get that, you know, the onion and the and the garlic just a little bit, just a touch. Yeah. And then, oh, that's just, we just stick with it. So now, see how simple it is? No, we just mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it. So we're gonna have our fish over here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna season top and bottom. Just grab a hand, just drizzle. Drizzle. 
so. And then we're gonna flip, flip all of it. <clears throat> Just uh, while we're prepping everything, it soaks in that dry rub. Don't, I didn't add any salt to it because garlic salt sometimes uh, gets a little too salty. Like if you add any salt to it, then it gets more salty. You know what I'm thinking right now though? Mm. I think um, when we have pork chops watching right now, he's gonna say, well, I can do better than that. <laughs> I mean, to each his own. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If we have pork chop, the way you do yours is, uh, <laughs> Shout out. Play pork chop. <laughs> oh yeah guys, I wanted to uh, do a little quick shout out to the um the new subscribers. Right? I mean I didn't get the name, but I would like to just shout you guys out. Thank you for uh, you know subscribing. We hit 406 subscribers right now, you know what I'm saying? Like nice. that's pretty cool. Thank you guys. I thought we would never even hit 400. It passed, you know, 400, so it was pretty cool. Um, the viewing the videos, uh, you know, uh, it was pretty cool. Um, one of the, I'm not gonna say, one of the company, the fishing company, hit us up. Um, so thank you. I mean, hopefully that goes through, and we'll see what we go to that. But I would like to shout those people out. Shout out. All right, so let's continue. All right, so now <clears throat> we grab a butter. So we have butter here. Right there. Corner. This one? Yep. Butter. So we're just gonna get what we need because we're gonna prep it now. All right, so we have butter. So we're gonna need our foiled. We've got foiled here. And alright, so now we have our classic olive oil, yep. uh, butter, all the things that we need to do. We need to uh, that we need for the for the prep. So what I do is I like to drizzle this. I forgot to drizzle this earlier. Just kind of What it does is it helps the keeps the flavor on the fish, you know, just that top. Because fish already got natural oil in it, you know, that's good for you. So just add it looks a look like a look of extra oomph to the fish. So just kind of mm -hmm. I can smell it's really good. Enhance the flavor. Enhance mm, yeah. super enhancer. Reverse it, reverse it. Side side. There you go. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab the fish. What you wanna do is see where this oil is at? You wanna put that on the bottom. So what it is is it doesn't have a skin. Yeah. So the oil keeps the meat from sticking to the oil. So yeah. we'll see later on when it when it gets good. Alright. So now you grab So I just like to do it both sides. More. Oh, that's how you do it, Chef? Yes. Okay. And then you get your butter. Oh, I say Chef. Chef. Shout out, Jip. <laughs> My name is Jip. Where are you, Jip? <laughs> <laughs> My name is Jip. Alright, so now we're just gonna grab 
Sorry for that noise from outside. Yeah. Yeah. Oh snap, look at that. So now we have that. Right? So what I, I like to do is just squeeze. Oh, oh, that. Make my own mouth watery right now. Yeah. Boom. So that's the reason why I left extra seasoning. Just a little. This is goes into some drizzle. Now we are. Going, I'm really not really good at folding things. You know? You're gonna put one on. Hold on. Uh, shout out to. There you go. There you go. You covered. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Don't that look oh. delicious? Man. Like that. We're gonna take it a little. Snap, look at that. Cool. Now you got a little, little there pack right there. So we're gonna do this to all of this fish. Yep. And then we'll see you guys. Cool. All right. Oh, snap. All right, guys. So we pretty much um, uh, wrapped up all of them. So we're on the last of the meat here. As you can see, I got two slides. That's the reason why there's two, uh, one and a half. Yep. Lemon in there, you know, so good. So now we're just gonna wrap this up and put this in the oven. As you, you hear that beep, that means it's ready, right? Just wrap this back up. I mean, I do it like this because it just holds that because it's gonna have juice. That fish juice to be in there, so you want to create a little pocket for that juice to hold. Good thing that this foil is super thick, so it kind of wraps around. Just pinch that booyah shaka right there. Boom, boom, boom. There you go. And that's it. Oh, so we're going to load this here and load, right load it in the oven. I'm just going to remove one here just to kind of free up. There you go. One. Boom. Nice. Look it, look it. All you need is a white wine to wash it down. Yup. Oh, snap. And a big bowl of rice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is set for 400 degrees, preheat, right, in the oven. Thank you. And this is gonna cook for about 20 minutes. It's a thin slice. There we there go. go. So we're gonna slide this in, 400. We'll All see right. you guys in 20 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes. And let's see how it goes. Oh, right. snaps. Boom, hey oh, guys, snaps. so we are finally done. Um, you know, actually we had to add uh, extra couple of minutes um, just to kind of get that final cook in there. And uh, yeah, the final result is here. So we're going to try oh, to get snap. one. We're going to open one and it's still hot. Just took it out of the oven and we're going to grab one here just to see how it looks. So there we go. There we go. Woo, look at that, guys. Boom. Oh, look at that. Look, look how nice that is. You know what I mean? You got your asparagus and you have oh. your meat. So if you go look, let's open it. Open. Oh my gosh, oh. look at it, look at it, look at it. You gotta taste that. You gotta taste this. There we go. Let's see how it tastes. There you go. Oh, that's mm. So mm. good. I wish you had. Take the asparagus out of here. Huh. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> Got it on camera. Man, it's so crunchy. Mm. Like what Blue, uh, Blue Game. Shout out Blue Game. I watch you all the time. You said you gotta have your asparagus crunchy. If it's too soft, it's no good. Mm. Dang, I heard that. All right, guys, so that's all right. it. We're gonna get together, eat this with the family. And uh, I would like to thank you guys for watching. So please like, share, and subscribe to this video and all the videos. View it and share it to your family. And uh, say thank you to somebody in the camera, behind the camera, Screw Sherman. Give me uh, spinning you around. Oh, snap. Right there. All right. 
So yeah, thank you guys for watching. So please like, share, subscribe, and all for the new new subscriber and all you guys are still viewing. I appreciate it. We appreciate it. Thank you guys very much. Till next time, guys. Oops, sorry. Till next time, guys. Adios. Oh snap. Oh snap. Bam.